In this video, I will do the 2D to 3D series with the Japanese character Doremon with low resolution. What we will do now is to place primitives similar to the shapes in the image one by one and validate them only. Now let's quickly place them all. First we have to look at which primitives fit our shape. Instead of sphere we will add cylinder for legs as well. Let's add cylinder and duplicate it with mirror and quickly place the hands and arms. In my previous videos, we always started with subdivide. In this video, we will create low resolution, that is, firstly without making any subdivides, letter we will need for mask and paint. We placed everything. Now let's turn off the image and make our adjustments. This is a very simple character. We don't need to make with high resolution, because there are no extra details using the tool except for some places. There will be places where we will increase the resolution. What we're going to do now is to create the mouth cavity with the Boolean method. For this, add sphere primitive and shape it according to the shape of its mouth using the drag tool and put it in its place on the image. Now close the sphere view we have shaped but keep it selected and choose the head. Select Voxel Merge and Remesh. Unhidden will be subtracted. Smooth the mouth with Smooth Tool. As you can see here, it is the a part of the body. Select Body and cut the upper part with Trim Tool. Now let's add Sphere for the tongue and shape it. Tap to Solo to work more comfy. Make Oval Shape and select Crease Tool. Sculpt the middle of the tongue. The sculpt looks bad because it's low resolution. So we need to subdivide. Tap to multi resolution and subdivide two times. Yes, now we were able to sculpt correctly with the crease tool. Shape our tongue with the drag tool. Pay attention to the radius setting while shaping. Tap to solo and place the tongue inside mouth. Select mask tool and add layer for head. Tap to screen to invert the mask. Let's unmask the white part in the middle of the face and inside the mouth. I just want to change the background color. Yellow is too shiny. Select head and name as head and record the process to the layer that we created before. Pick the blue color from image. Tap to screen to invert the mask and paint to blue. Open the layer and control the record. Change the layer name. This layer is the color of head. Clear the mask. Tap screen and mask the head and unmask the area around mouth. Open a new layer and name as mouth color. Invert mask and pick the mouth color from image and paint inside the mouth. This layer will be the mouth color layer. You can change the color if you want. Clear the mask. Tap to solo. Now select mask tool. Tap to screen to mask and unmask the white area of body. But because the body sphere has low resolution, we can see these alias. To get rid of it, let's subdivide it once so that we can make a better mask. Now we can make a smoother mask with multi-resolution. Add layer for body, invert the mask and paint to blue. We arrange the body color. Clear the mask. Select head and tap to solo. And with tube tool select curve, snap, closed, and input tube around the white part of the face. Let's place it on the face properly and thin it with an amber colored radius and validate. Now color the tube to black color. Tap to solo. Select the tube tool and do the same thing we did to face, around the white part of body and for the middle pocket. Yes, the black lines are complete. Let's make mustaches with tube tool. Choose tube tool and shape on the image. Duplicate with mirror and make thinner. Select mirror and tube, move to the middle. Now clone the tube and make the other mustaches, move with gizmo. Replace the mustaches where they are seen in the image using gizmo and paint them all black. Select mirror and validate as join children. Let's choose the tube tool again and make the black line in the middle of the face and color to black from stroke painting. It's time to add a sphere to make eyes, shape them as an image and clone for the other eye. 
now open shading menu and choose the white matte cap to see the colors. Let's color the places that need to be colored. Paint the tongue and neck rope to red. Add sphere for the nose, put to its place color to red and validate. From stroke menu, choose intensity and color to black and white. We painted the nose and let's choose the eye and paint it too. As you can see, there is an alias in the painting. Now there is a precision painting and mask in low resolution. For this, we need to subdivide the eyes and nose. Let's subdivide them all once. Paint the nose. Nose looks okay, but there is still alias in the eye. So we need to subdivide the eyes one more time. Now let's choose dot from the stroke menu and draw an oval pupil. Yes, it looks smoother now. Choose the density for the white shiny circle. Yes, only the little bell on the neck remained in Doremon. For this, add sphere, tap to solo and select the mask tool. Tap the screen once and mask it. Open the symmetry menu. Turn off the X plane, select Y plane, and make radial Y32 and select world. Draw a straight line in the middle of the circle. Turn the gizmo on its side and enlarge the white part outward with the amber colored ring. Now clear the mask and select trim tool. Select ellipse and feel hole and turn off symmetry. Sculpt a hole then select rectangle. Let's remesh with voxel merge to soften it more easily. Because it's too soft at very low resolution, so we can distort the shape. Tap to solo and move the bell to its place. Change the matte cap from shading menu. What we need to do now is to connect the parts with voxel merge. So let's pick the parts one by one. Go to that menu and remesh with 1200 resolution. Turn off the painting and smooth the merge parts with smooth tool. We can join the tubes and decrease the poly count with voxel merge. We merge the body with voxel merge. Now decimate the body and decrease its poly count. Our Japanese character Doremon is finished. Now just lighting after that. If you wish, you can watch my video about lighting. I'll come to the end of my video. If you want to learn more please check out my other videos.